Welcome back to Schools Challenge Quiz. It's the second match in Friday's doubleheader, and the scores are Calabar High on 23 points, Cornwall College on 18 points. Calabar picked up three points in the break for the following questions. What part of the human body is tasked with receiving the oxygenated blood from the rest of the body? The judges will accept right side of the heart. And to translate to English, no me gusta el invierno, the judges will accept I don't like the winter. And who directed the 2013 film, 12 Years a Slave, they will accept Steve McQueen. And now we get into our buzzer challenge. Teams must press the buzzer, wait to be identified before giving their answer. Two points will be added for correct answers, but teams will lose two points if the answer is incorrect. Teams, it's time to gear up with your quick fingers, quick thinking, and some fast answers, which could put you one step closer to winning the championship. Let's have four minutes on the clock, please, as our first question comes from Bible Knowledge. Which of the following New Testament books mentioned the Old Testament Noah story? Matthew, Mark, Luke, or John? Matthew and Luke. Biology. What is the main source of lipase in your digestive tract located? Or where is the main source? Cornwall? Liver. Liver. No, in the pancreas. English language. Spell isthmus. Uh, Calabar. I-S-T-H-M-U-S. Yeah. Correct. Local affairs. Look at the clip. Identify this person. That's Dr. Janet Dyer, Managing Director of Heart Trust NTA. Chemistry. If an atom has 13 electrons, how many shells will have Cornwall? Three. Correct. Three electrons. Music. Listen to the clip. Give the title of the song. Someone just to sit with me when I need a help and hand. Again, general knowledge. The La Moneda Palace is the home of the president in which South American country? Chile. Spanish. Translate the following sentence to English. Mi hermano habla lenta y claramente. Calabar. My brother, My brother speaks, speaks long and clear. clear. Incorrect. My brother speaks slowly and clearly. Oh. Geography. What type of cloud is associated with thunderstorms and uh, Cornwall College? Cumulonimbus. Correct. Heavy precipitation. Theatre and cinema. Look at the monitor. Identify this person. Doris Day. Information technology. What device does a hybrid computer use to convert digital signals? Cornwall? Modem. Correct, from a computer into analog signals. History. Name one of the Roman emperors who signed the Edict of Milan in the 3rd century AD. Constantine or Licinius. Mathematics. What is the number of subsets for a set with 10 elements? Calabar. 1024. 1024. Correct. Physics. What is the most common term for the type of energy that is directly related to the energy of atoms? Cornwall College. Nuclear energy. energy. Incorrect. Molecules and other small particles that are in random motion within a system, and that would be thermal. Sports. Look at the monitor. Identify this person. Kemoy Campbell. Jamaican heritage. In which parish can you find the community of Minosen Yunokom? Calabar. Clarendon. Incorrect. Trelawney. And French. Translate to the following, the following sentence to English. Je suis arrivé en retard pour l'école. Calabar. I, I arrived late for school. That's correct. Literature, give the subtitle for this 1888 novel by Robert Louis Stevenson. The Black Arrow. A Tale of Two Roses. Art, the persistence of memory. Uh, Cornwall College. Melting clocks. No, it is the 1931 painting of which Spanish artist? That would be Salvador Dali. Bible knowledge, give the name of the Israelite whose death was occasioned by his touching of the Ark, Calabar. Uzzah. Uzza. Correct. Biology, what is the name of the layer of the inner lining of the stomach which is densely packed with gastric glands? 
and there is no time for that answer, Mukosa. That's the end of the final challenge and the end of our match. The scores at this time are Cornwall College on 18 and Calabar on 27. Here now is the answer to the Digicel viewers' question. And the answer is Paris Saint-Germain. Congratulations to our winners. We'll double check those scores and return with the final results right after these messages.